back to the Moran family. So today's video is another haul video, but it's for baby girl. I'm currently 21 weeks pregnant with my rainbow baby, my fourth daughter. So finally, I started shopping for baby girl. So I'm so excited to show you guys what I got for her. I haven't bought too many things yet. So I did buy everything off of Amazon. So the first thing I have to share with you guys are actually boppy pillow covers. I'll have everything linked down below in the description. So these are just the same exact prints. I ended up getting two of them just in case baby girl has a blowout. Um, she spits up all of that stuff so that way if one gets dirty I can just pop the other one in the wash and I'll be good so here is what it looks like it's just a white boppy pillow cover and then it has flowers all over it I have five outfits to share with you guys but they are the cutest and they're my favorite I think I already have baby girls coming home outfit picked out and I'll show you guys that in a second so the first one that I have to share with you guys, and this one might be my favorite. I didn't think Benny was gonna like this outfit, but he actually loves it as well. So it's a little sweatsuit, I guess you can call it. So here is the top. It's so cute. It has a rainbow on it because she is our rainbow baby. Like how cute is this? And I know it'll keep her warm too, because like I said, she's going to be born in the fall time. So I know this is going to come in handy. And then the bottoms are, oh my gosh, like how cute are these? They're little sweats. And then you can tie them right here. And then the back is a little ruffle booty. Like how adorable is this set? Like if they had this in Layla size and Aurora size, I would totally buy it. So the next outfit that I have to share with you guys, I actually just got this one in the mail yesterday. And if you follow me on Instagram, then you've already seen it because Aurora was so excited when I showed her this outfit. So I actually posted a picture of her holding it. She was like so proud that this was her little sister's. So here is the little outfit. How cute is this? It's like in this really pretty camel khaki brown color. And then the shoulders have like these little flutter sleeves. I think those are so cute. And then it has little wooden beads. It's ribbed. This feels like it's going to keep baby girl warm as well. So I think this is just, it's so cute. Like I told you guys, I'm into like the more neutral tones. Next one that I got is kind of like the last one that I just showed you. So here's what it looks like. It's in this really pretty like pink purplish color. It has the same wooden buttons, same ribbed material but this one does not have the flutter sleeve. So that's the only difference between this one and the last one. So the next two outfits that I have to share with you guys, and these are actually the last outfits that I have. Here is the first one. So it's in this really pretty sage color. I've been so obsessed with this color lately. I just think it's so pretty. So it's just a zip up sleeper, which are a must. Baby girl is going to be living in these for her first couple months of being born because like I said, she's going to be born in the cold. So like I said, it's just a simple zip up sleeper. So it has the feet and then what I really, really like about these, these are lifesavers. If you're a new mom, buy sleepers that have these. It has the fold over like mittens. So this part just folds over their hand and then their hands are completely covered. These are a must, especially if your baby's going to be born like in the cold or if you just want your baby's hands to be covered because newborn's nails tend to get really sharp and you don't want them to like scratch their face. So these come in handy because my experience with the little mittens that go on their hands, they fall off all the time they don't stay on that great and then i end up losing them because they just fall all over the place so these ones i highly recommend so that's why i picked up some of these i plan on getting their other colors because i believe they were out of stock which is why i only got two of them the next outfit is literally the same but here is the color it's in this really pretty like mauve purple color 
This one actually might be baby girl's coming home outfit. I just want to keep her super cozy and comfortable when she comes home. So I'm probably going to put her in this one. It's in size newborn. And then the last one I showed you guys is in zero to three months. So I'll probably just end up packing both of them for the hospital just in case baby girl tends to be big. I mean, I doubt it because all of my kids have been like seven pounds and then Everly was like four pounds. So I highly doubt she's not going to fit in the newborn one, but just in case I'll bring like an extra one. But this is probably going to be baby girl's coming home outfit and it just makes my heart so excited. So the next things I have to share with you guys are some swaddle blankets. I ended up just buying two right now just so I can see how I like these. So this is by the brand Mushy. I got them off of Amazon though, but I'm pretty sure you can get these off their website. I haven't opened these at all, so I don't even know how these feel. So these are muslin swaddles. Muslin swaddles are my favorite. I never had any issues of my children like breaking out of them or anything like that. So I'm just basically getting what I know works for me and what has worked previously for my other children. So I've just been going with what I know I love. So muslin blankets were a must for me. So I'm going to get quite a few for baby girl. That way I can keep her all bundled and warm. So here's what it looks like. It's super big. So I'm super excited for this. And then the next one that I got is in this really pretty like mustard yellow color which also screams fall to me so here's what this one looks like so pretty like these colors are gorgeous the last things that i have to share with you guys are actually like organization things for her nursery her nursery is going to be in our master bedroom so i've just been really looking into like organization things and just like a bunch of bins a bunch of baskets that way like she has her things all organized and it doesn't get like all crazy in our bedroom so the first thing that i have to share with you guys and if you've seen my vlog where i cleaned out like our closets and stuff then you've already seen these so these are little bins that go inside of your dresser and then you can just put whatever you want in it so they come in a pack of six i believe you can get like a pack of two four six maybe even eight i'm not too sure but you can get like a bunch of different options if you want and they also come in a bunch of other colors but i just went with the gray ones because most of the things in my room are like gray black and white so i just went with these ones so it comes with a bunch of different sizes too so these are the small ones and then this is the medium one and then inside my dresser i also have like a big one which is like a big square one so the other things that i have for her changing station are these baskets right here they're macrame baskets and i'm so excited for these these are so gorgeous like the quality of these are amazing like they definitely exceed my expectations so here is what it looks like it comes in a pack of two it has like these really pretty wooden handles so i plan on putting these on top of my dresser like i said my dresser is going to be used for baby girls changing station so i plan on putting these on top of my dresser i think i'm going to use because it comes in two sizes so there's a big one and then there's a smaller one so i think i'm going to use the bigger one for diapers and then probably like a pack of wipes and then i think i'm going to use the smaller one for like her lotions. So the last thing that I have to share with you guys is this guy right here. And this is actually a diaper caddy. I have a whole bunch of like towels rolled up in it because whenever you buy like rope baskets online, they come super flat. So you have to like stuff things in it to reshape it. So I have all of these towels. Let me take them out really quickly so I can show you guys. So here is what the inside looks like so this basket is really large it also comes with the dividers in it so you can just put them kind of like let me see how i want this so here's what the inside looks like once the dividers are in so i plan on using this as it's intended so i'm gonna put like her diapers in here 
her wipes, maybe like her comb and her brush, all that stuff. So I plan on just using it as a diaper caddy. I really like this one because it doesn't look like your average diaper caddy and it fits like the whole boho vibe that I'm going for again. So I really like the look of this one. And then another bonus is that it actually comes with stroller straps. Another thing that also came with the diaper caddy that I had no idea about until I opened it but it also comes with this bag, so I thought that was neat as well. It says baby essentials on it, and then it has like pictures. So I thought it was really cool that it came with this too. Well, that is everything that I bought, baby girl. Like I said, I didn't buy too many things, but I really wanted to share everything with you guys because I'm just so excited, and it just feels like a weight off of my shoulder now that I've started to buy her things. And I'm just, I'm so excited and I'm just so excited to like document this pregnancy for you guys. So I have a OB appointment this coming Wednesday on the 1st and then Tuesday the 2nd is finally my anatomy scan. So I plan on filming both of those days. Hopefully they let me film baby girl for you guys because I haven't seen her in so long. The last time I saw her. She was so tiny. I'm crossing like all my fingers and all my toes that they let me film a little bit because Benny still is not able to go in the room with me and I'm so sad about it because I'm kind of nervous for my anatomy scan and I don't want to go alone. But with everything going on with COVID, it still has to only be me. So I'm going to just pray about it and you know just think good thoughts about it so hopefully they let me film it even if it's just like a few minutes that way i can share that with him and share that with the girls and share it with you guys but as always i'm so out of breath you guys if you enjoyed this video make sure you give it a thumbs up make sure you guys are subscribed to the Moran family and make sure you hit that bell that way you guys always get notified every single time we upload and i'll see you guys in my next video bye guys Let's get some